Yo, 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 what is going on guys? My name is Jordan and today I have a fun video for you guys and it's on a topic that I get asked a lot, a lot of questions on and that is my sweatpants. Now, if you know me, you can probably catch me in sweatpants seven days out of the week. I absolutely love wearing sweatpants. So they're definitely a staple that I have to have in my collection. And it seems like a lot of you guys are really, really curious on the type of sweatpants that I wear, the brand that I wear, or brands I should say. And I thought, you know what? Let me make a quick video for you guys, just showing off a couple of sweatpants that I wear and the pros and cons with each of them and show you maybe like a fit or two about each of them. So without further ado, cue the intro. Let's get straight into the video. Okay guys, so if you guys are anything like me, I don't really consider myself to have a style or a hype style per se. I wear what I like and my style might change up on a daily basis. Um, some days I wanna wear baggy, some days I wanna wear fitted, some days I wanna fit, wear tight. It all depends on the mood that day. So I definitely need to have variety in my wardrobe or something versatile, which is what I'm gonna show you soon. So every single thing here I do pick up in my true to size size, which is a large and I do wear um, a size waist 34. So keep that in mind when I'm showing you the on body. So let's get straight into the first pair. And it's a pair that I've owned for a long time now. So they're a bit beat up, but I thought I'd show them to you anyway. All right, guys. So the first pair I do have is from a brand that I mentioned maybe one or twice on this channel already. And it's a pair of charcoal sweatpants from the brand Other UK. And I don't know if you can tell on camera, but these are a bit beat up. Um, the little eyelets here are coming off and everything, but it's okay. I don't really mind any of those things, but I absolutely love the color on these. These might want to be one of those sweatpants that I wear on a day-to-day -day basis. They're absolutely amazing. And these are definitely a slim fitting, kind of tighter pair of sweats. And they also do feature a nice cuff there at the bottom. So. I don't always like to wear cuffs, but these are definitely one of the sweatpants that I do not mind wearing cuffs on. So let's get into the details about this pair. These sweats do feature kind of long drawstrings there, and they do feature a little eyelet with other branded right there. Now, like I told you, these are beat up. So a bit of a bunch of the paint is chipping off, but to me, that's pretty cool. It's kind of like a rustic feel. So it adds to the aesthetic I find of these sweats and I absolutely love the color on these. They're like a cement greenish gray color. Um, there's not really much to say about these sweats other than the fact that I absolutely love them. Um, like I said, I've owned them for a while now and you know, you can't go wrong with a nice pair of straight leg sweats. So that's pair number one. Let me show you pair number two. Let's get it. All right, guys. So the next two pairs are from a brand that you guys have definitely heard me mention on this channel before. And I'm pretty sure you guys have already heard about it. And that is, yes, the fear of God essential sweats. Now this here is in like a neon yellow colorway. And I absolutely love these. I do have these in three colors. I believe I have gray, uh, a pink, and I have these as well, as well as the polar fleece sweats that I showed you in my last video, which I'm gonna show you right here if you guys wanna go check them out. So anyways, let me show you all the details on these right here. You guys are probably familiar with Fear God Essential Sweats. So you do get the branding right there on the front with the rubberized tab. And you do get the long drawstrings that you do get from all the sweats of Fear of God. And what I really, really like about these pair is that you do get the Essentials logo there on the left leg like usual, but instead of being printed on, it's like stitched, which is what something that I really like. So you don't have to worry about that coming off or anything. So in the last pair of sweats I just showed you, I mentioned that it had a long cuff, which is not something that I necessarily like personally, but um, this one here does have a small cuff, which is, you know, pretty good. This is something more along the lines of something that I personally like. And I like that it is not too big and out there. So 
These are definitely a pair of sweats that I like to wear a lot. I mean, these are bright yellow, so I don't wear this colorway as much as I would, let's say, the gray. But this is definitely something when I want to feel flashy and out there, this is definitely something that I will go to. So sometimes I don't like to be flashy and I do have the gray pair and I definitely must say that having a pair of gray sweats in your wardrobe is a must. I'm pretty sure everybody definitely owns a pair of gray and the only difference between this pair and the pair I just showed you is that the Essentials branding there on the leg is kind of printed on instead of stitched, but so far so good. I've worn these plenty of times and I've never seen to have any issues with that coming off. So. These are definitely probably the sweatpants that I personally wear the most as they do have like a baggier fit as you've probably seen on the on bodies and it's just something that I like to go to when I feel like being cozy and baggy and maybe not try so hard to be so stylish or something like that. So pick up a pair of essential sweats if you haven't already, you will not regret it. These are definitely some of my favorites, but I'm probably going to move into my favorite pair next, the last pair that I have for you. So. If you want to see that one stay tuned for the next one all right guys so moving into my last pair of sweats that i'm going to show you guys and these right here are definitely a premium sweatpants by all extensions of the word premium now these are going to run you around 125 pounds not dollars pounds so these are definitely a pricey sweatpant and but for me personally, I had to pick these up as I saw that the way these fit on the model on the website was just exactly what I was looking for. So I decided to pick them up anyway. So the pair of pants that I am talking about are the gray melange sweatpants from Represent Clothing. And if you know Represent, the premium quality that they put out is bar none. It's absolutely amazing. So I was extremely confident picking these up that these were going to be exactly what I wanted and I was a hundred percent right. So with that being said, let's get straight into the details why I think that this sweatpant is a must. All right guys, so the first detail about these pants are that you're going to get a rubber kind of string here in the front as well as the pull tab to tighten the waist. And what I really like about that is you don't really sacrifice any length of your strings by having to tie them and then adjust them to any certain size. You have the perfect size that you're looking for right away, which is something that I personally love. And then you're also going to get the staple represent metal bar right there on the front. It's kind of like a faux zipper. There's no actual opening there, but it kind of has the impression that there is one. And on the back, you are going to get a back pocket as well that is kind of velcroed closed so you can open that tighten it put stuff back there nothing will fall out which is something that i personally love you do get like a french terry interior so these pants are pretty warm so you can easily wear these in the winter but they're not warm to the point where you can't wear them in the summer so these pants are perfect for me um here in canada it gets pretty cold in the winter time so that's perfect and it gets pretty hot in the summer so I don't have to worry about that. I can just throw these on and I know I'm good all year. All right, so when it comes to sweatpants for me, like I mentioned before, I like to change up my style all the time. So when it comes to versatility, that is definitely a huge plus in the sweatpant department for me. So you can definitely wear these baggy and you can wear these tapered as they do have these little metal tongles there at the bottom so you can adjust the taperedness of your sweat. So that right there for me is a huge, huge, huge plus in the sweatpants department because the other two that I just showed you, you can't do that. You wear them as they come. And me personally, I love to be able to adjust my sweats. Just, I love to have different fits. If I'm wearing something tight, I wear something baggy at the bottom. And if I'm wearing something baggy on top, I like to wear something tight at the bottom. So these are definitely perfect. And one of the best features about these is that they do have represent branded zippers on the pocket. So you can zip your pockets up, put your keys, your AirPods, whatever you need to put in your pockets and they will not fall out. So these are definitely my favorite sweats in my collection to date. All right, guys, now that's the end of the video for today. And I hope you guys really enjoyed this video as, as I had a lot of fun making it. So 
With that being said, I really, really appreciate you guys for stopping by. And if you guys want to hit me up on Instagram and ask me any questions, you can hit me up at right here. That's my Instagram name. So hit me up, DM me, chat me up. I love hearing from all you guys. I say that every video and it's because I absolutely mean it. So with that being said, for those of you guys who are new here and or not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button down below. Turn the post notifications on and hit me up a comment and I, I, I promise I will respond to you guys. So thank you guys again so, so much for stopping by. Thank you guys for all the people that have supported me up until this point because you guys have definitely motivated me to keep making videos. So thank you, thank you guys so, so much. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace, y'all.